Hey guys, my name is Dave, and welcome to another video. So, today I actually kind of wanted to give a brief history of me and music. So, this is kind of something random, maybe, to you guys that kind of popped up, but I've been doing... I've been involved in the topic of music since I was, like, four years old. I've had quite a passion for it. It's one of the reasons that, like, one, one of the things that keep me uplifted are the kind of songs I listen to, as that's the case for a lot of people. But anyway, a little bit of a history on this. This might be a short video, because I don't know how I'm going to explain this. It's completely unscripted, as always, but, well, let's get into it. Four years old, at four years old, I actually took a gander at trying out the violin. I... I did enjoy it at first. I've always been the kind of person who... was kind of a perfectionist at this kind of stuff, and whenever I slipped up, I'd be like, ugh. <laughs> I still do that to this day sometimes. I'm better at hiding it now than I was back then, you know, because I was like four years old, but... I very, very, very quickly stopped playing the violin. Looking back now, I don't know if that would have been really the instrument I would have... Um, <clears throat> ended up extending on really enjoying anyway. Can't confirm that, but... That being said, a couple years later, I landed on the soft spot of the piano, which... That is the one I ended up sticking to, aside from like singing, which I really enjoy doing a lot. Um, piano, the way I, when I first started playing the piano, the thing that inspired me to do it, I believe, was um, a lot of like the classical type music, like Furley's or, um, well actually no, it was mainly Furley's now that I think about it. That, I mean, th there are a couple other things that where I was like going, oh, I wish I kn knew how to play that. If I look back now, I could probably go, oh, you will. <laughs> um, but I started learning how to play the piano at the age of five and a half, six, something like that. And kind of pushed forward from that. Um, for years, I got better and better. I It got to the point where as if I were to go back, and I don't have like a keyboard or anything with me right now because of reasons I'm not going to get into right now. Uh, <laughs> but I've gotten to the point where I could literally just do it by muscle memory, which for someone who really thoroughly enjoys music as a whole, for the most part, um, I actually like the fact that I could just go whenever I want and just start playing. Not always perfect, but you know, that's kind of what happens when you have a delay of playing for a long period of time. That being said, um, I think the one thing that I have probably had the most history with would definitely be singing, as most people would. It's more of a hobby for me than anything else, all three of the, like, any, any kind of music thing, but I would, whenever I'm, like, working on, like, editing or uploads, which I don't do many edits, but I do um, try to do what I can. Um, I think the thing that got me into the singing portion of it, all of it the most, was actually the, uh, the play Phantom of the Opera. I actually do enjoy the music in that a lot, along with stuff like Enya, um, specifically Wild Child. Um, there, I, I would go on a ramble for a long period of time which songs that pinpointed the biggest highlights of the reason why I like singing so much. That, that, that would take forever. But definitely, that, those were definitely the first couple that did kind of push that. Uh, Phantom of the Opera, specifically the song Phantom of the Opera, and Enya's Wild Child, eventually coming out to be Kryptonite by Three Doors Down. Um, 
and in the long haul inevitably ended up landed on the soft spots where I am today, where I've got like this long playlist of instrumentals that I'll just go, like, I'll sing things like Gone Away uh, by The Offspring, or um, something like We're the Same by Try Hard Ninja. Quite the variety of stuff, but honestly, the only reason I feel so comfortable doing it, and openly too, as long as, you know, no copyright is really involved, is because of that history of me having so much of a history on music to the point where I feel comfortable doing it whenever, wherever. And this, not everyone can hit that point, and I get that, but I'm kind of an open person to the point where I don't, I don't care what people think on that front. Anyway, yeah, that's my history with music in kind of in a nutshell. Um, if you guys want to, if you have any interest in any kind of aspect you'd like to hear, um, any stories you want to hear that have involved like a very specific topic or any thoughts of any specific type of topic that you want to want me to bring up, whether in an about me or a discussion or rent a video, let me know in the comments below. If you liked this particular video, push that like button and so far you can't sit anymore. If you really liked it and you like this kind of stuff, consider subscribing to the channel. I do one every three days. Oh gosh, hiccups. Sorry, I just ate something like 30 minutes or an hour ago. Mm. However, in the meantime, I'm going to head off, but I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye for now.